Alright, your next comment coming to the stage. She's a very lovely person, really funny. Give it up for Vanessa Hemet! <laughs> My bank is judging my tips. Capital One emailed me and it said, I noticed you left a 50% tip on your bill. I hope you left this tip for great service. If that's right, you're good to go. Now, I am paranoid about tipping in the opposite direction. <laughs> Capital One would email me, I saw you left a 5% tip on your bill. We hope you left this tip because you're an asshole. <laughs> If that's right, you're good to go. <laughs> I just got engaged. Woo! <laughs> kind of exciting. We're going to bakeries every weekend now to test out wedding cake, which is really exciting. Love is great, but free vanilla cake with a buttercream frosting and raspberry mousse is amazing. <laughs> We're thinking about going to Hawaii on our honeymoon, so I was looking at Google reviews. Then, I found out that there are actually reviews of the Pacific Ocean on Google. <laughs> one guy gave the Pacific Ocean a one. <laughs> what would prompt someone to do that? Of all the oceans that I've been to, this is absolutely the worst. I got an ad on Facebook, suggested for you from NorthJersey.com. It said, anyone looking for a new home with a ballroom, a 65-foot saltwater pool, and a heated driveway? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but I'd also be looking for $33 million. <laughs> they must be trying to start a movement where we all pool our money together. <laughs> if they're targeting a million people in the tri-state area for $33, Count me in. <laughs> the Whole Foods that I go to, it's like they're always crowded. But I figured out a way to clear the place out. I give them the avocado scare. I taped a sign outside, sorry, we're out of avocados. <laughs> I got the place to myself. <laughs> the truth really matters because there's so much hype everywhere, especially in food. If I go to Five Guys, I want to see the Five Guys preparing my order. <laughs> if I go to the Cheesecake Factory, I want to see an assembly line of children <laughs> making cheesecake. <laughs> the founder of the Cheesecake Factory is David Overton. A fitting last name since when you leave, you weigh over a ton. <laughs> I was buying an airline ticket. It used to be economy or first class. So there was no choice at all because it's economy. No one flies first class. Now, airlines are dividing up economy. There's basic economy, which means you get nothing. No food, no space. You do get one thing, a reminder that in the words of our president, you're a loser. <laughs> Then there's regular economy. You still get nothing. You're still a loser. But you get to board before the total losers in basic economy. <laughs> then there's premium economy. That's like the airlines telling you, you are close to first class. You can actually look at them for a while before we close the curtain. <laughs> you get a little more leg room. Oh, toe room. And if you're willing to pay double the economy fare for that, you're a loser and an idiot. <laughs> Thank you.